Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Tarun Josh. Today we are diving into a topic that holds immense value for aspiring product designers. I'm going to let you in on the secrets on how to craft a mesmerizing case study that will practically guarantee your job in the competitive world of product design. And believe me, it's a story worth telling. Picture this, you have honed your design skills, you got the passion, you are eager to break into the industry, but now, how do you effectively communicate your talent and stand out from the crowd? That's where case study is coming to picture. Now you might wonder, what's the magic ingredient to unlock this job getting case study? It's simple, really, storytelling. Because behind every great product lies even greater story waiting to be unleashed. Case studies are more than just a boring checklist of what you did. It is a visual narrative that walks employers through your design process from ideation to final execution. It's a powerful storytelling tool that not only showcases your creativity but also demonstrates your ability to think critically and solve complex challenges. Employers want to see real-world examples of how you approach problems, collaborate with teams and ultimately deliver exceptional user experiences. Case studies provide a window into your design thinking and decision making process giving employers the confidence that you are the right fit for their organization i have a game changing tip for your portfolio which i will tell you at the end of video so stick till the end now let's set the stage with a few mocked up screens of the final outcome showcasing the best parts of your ui to build the interest for your audience ready let's dive into crafting the ultimate case study start with defining the problem you faced the pain points of the users that cried out for solution and how you owe to save the day. Your project needs a noble quest, so outline your goals, your design vision and the impact you wanted to make in the lives of your users that will make hiring managers soon. Then outline the key elements of your case study. For example, team. Mention how many passionate minds join forces to conquer the challenge. Example, two designers, one researcher, one project manager and four engineers, etc. Showing that you are a team player and have collaborated with other departments to bring the project to life. Indicate year when this incredible project began. Because if your case study is old, this indicates your skills are better than the ones shown in the case study. Also share time taken to forge the perfect design this displays your speed and commitment to the project. Include the tools used in the process like FigJam, Figma, Hotjar, Google Analytics, Google Drive, Zoom, Slack or whatever tools you used in the process to design, record your research, save your work, collaborate, conduct usability tests, etc. This will make clear that you are up to the industry standards in terms of tools. Now add your contribution in this grand adventure. Finally, to complete outline, link the live project link if you can for authenticity. Moving on, this is a very important section to showcase. Flaunt the mesmerizing results that left everyone in awe. From increasing user engagement to receiving rave reviews, let the numbers and the user feedback speak for themselves. This establishes the fact that you are a result-oriented designer. Next up, as designers, we make a lot of assumptions before we start the project and we validate them in the design process. So unveil the assumptions you made and discuss the rationale behind them. Well now, there is no project without constraints, so introduce the constraints, be it limited resources, time, budget, screen size or technology technological limitations, share how these constraints sparked innovative solutions and forced you to think out of box, ultimately leading to an ingenious, resourceful design. Highlight the lessons you learned from navigating through these limitations and how they sharpened your problem solving skills. But wait, before the research, let's rewind a bit. Remember, every project needs a plan. Reveal your brilliant week by week plan the roadmap that guided you through darkest design challenges also show at what point you have involved researchers, project managers, developers, illustrators, business owners, customers in your design process. What was the feedback loop like? Keep this section as visual as possible. We spoke about design process, but what was it? Was it design thinking process or double diamond process or whatever it is? Present it and then move on to the heart of our story, research. Unravel the secrets uncovered through competitive analysis, analytic tools, usability testing, share the stories, the emotions, processes you followed like filtering criteria for interviewees, 
writing interview script, the notes you took and the insights that fueled your creativity. Don't hold back, add images, videos, screenshots, affinity maps, empathy map, etc. and recordings to immerse your audience in your world. Finally, show the user archetypes you have created based on the research. I know, research is confusing topic to many budding designers as there are multiple methods to do research but you know, there is step by step process to do proper user research. We'll explore that in my upcoming videos. So subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to get notification when I release a new video. Moving on to the ideation stage, elaborate on the brainstorming techniques you used. Then how did you find and filter participants for your brainstorming session? What are the pitfalls did you expect and resolve? How did you avoid them? How did you plan your workshop? What ideas did your team come up with? And how did you prioritize the ideas? Once this is done, show the user stories, journeys and user flow. After all this, now comes the fun part, converting your ideas to wireframes based on the user flow and research insights. Display your sketches and digital explorations that brought your vision to life, explaining important design decisions. Next up, the thrilling trials and tribulations. Talk about how did you recruit your users for your usability test? What flows did you test and what learnings did you find? Let your audience witness the moments that you tweaked, adjusted and fine-tuned to perfection. Before showing off your final year, there is one more thing, the design system, the secret to maintaining order in a chaotic world of design. Demonstrate the reasoning for choosing color palettes, the typography and shapes. Add the raw file link to design system with a screenshot or display multiple slides with spacing guidelines, UI elements and their states, iconography, media that reflects the brand and evoke the connection to your users. With the design system in place, reveal the breathtaking polished UI design flow and write a line or two about how you ensured that every screen felt cohesive and intuitive, creating a delightful experience that invited users to explore and engage with the app. Let your audience revel in the beauty, the simplicity and the elegance of your creation. Show screens in a carousal or in a fancy mock-up to create more thrilling experience to your audience audience add recordings of your prototypes. At the end, talk about developer handoff. What was the process? What were the pushbacks and the challenges did you face in the process from different stakeholders and how did you resolve them? And also present if you have created any documentation for developers and photographs of final implementation and people using the product. And that, my friends, is how you weave a capitative case study, a story that showcases your brilliance, your creativity, and your unwavering determination. I know you're waiting for the game-changing tip that I mentioned at the start. Here it is. It's not about writing more, but showing more. Focus on concise text, but elevate your case study with high quality, realistic photographs, mock-ups, GIFs, and videos. Sprinkle your sassy language, add capitative headings, and use emojis to spice things up. Proper spacing is crucial in presenting your masterpiece. Now you have the knowledge, the passion, and the charm to conquer any UI UX design job that comes your way. And remember, you're not just a designer, you're a storyteller. But is this all you need to know become a product designer? No, there is more coming. That is why subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon. That's all for today guys. This is Tarun Josh signing off.